Hey guys, iOS 18.5 developer beta 4 is out as you can see the update size is about 872 MBs. It will be different for a different iPhone over here. This is iPhone 16 and this is what I am getting on the iPhone 16 model. Finally, after a week of beta 3, beta 4 is over here. In this video, I'm going to talk about how you can install this update and is there anything interesting in this update or not. I'm also going to share some of the battery stats. Um, of 18.5 so you can have the idea about how the performance is going on so far so without any further delay let's dive into this video the first thing first how you can install this update simply go to settings go to general go to software update and over here you will see the update if you are already on the developer beta profile make sure it is developer beta over here and you will see the update for now public beta update is not out it will come out later today or maybe tomorrow Definitely, I will let you know guys when it will come out. As you can see, I haven't installed the update yet. Right after this video, I'm going to install this update. And if I talk about what is new, there was nothing new in the beta 3. So, we cannot expect anything in the beta 4. Still, if I find anything interesting in the beta 4, I will definitely make another video to let you know guys. But I'm not expecting anything from this update. Um, 18.5 is not a big update. It's all about enhancements, um, better battery life and stuff. And yes, Apple did that very, very well. There are a few things that are new in the iOS 18.5. I did a video about that and you can go, go to my channel and check out those videos. But yes, Apple actually improved battery life a lot. And they also improved the performance a lot in this update. If I go to the battery stats and show you how the battery is performing. Because I tested every other iOS 18.5 beta. And right now I'm running beta 3. I will install the beta 4 after this video. So I want to show you the stats of beta 3. Now as you can see over here, I use more than 50%, like 65% over here. And I got almost 6 hours of screen on time. This is really good. I use, you know, different applications, WhatsApp, Perplexity, and some other applications. And yeah, battery life is really good. Today, I used 50% of my device and I got 5 hours and 19 minutes screen on time. Now during this time, I use Instagram, Netflix, TikTok, WhatsApp, and some other applications. And yes, for the 50%, this screen on time is really, really good. So yeah, battery life is really improved in the, in the iOS 18.5. I personally believe I tested out every other iOS 18 version, starting from the iOS 18.0 until today. And I can easily say this is one of the best battery life so far. Um, in the iOS 18.3, we used to get a good battery life. Then, you know, some people were facing battery draining issues and all those things were happening. But with this update, everything is really, really good. And yes, in terms of performance, everything is battery smooth. In the previous versions of iOS 18.4 and iOS 18.4.1, you can say, I was facing lag with the camera control. Like when I opened the camera, I was getting a bit of a, a small lag while opening. Like animation was a bit lagging. Also, when I open, you know, the um, visual intelligence, something like this, I was also getting a lag. But after coming to the iOS 18.5, everything seems very, very smooth. I'm not facing any sort of problem. As you can see, I selected the black magic camera on the camera control. But I'm not going to use a black magic or cam over here. I'm going to switch to the um, default app. But yeah, things are really, really nice. Things are smoother on the iOS 18.5. Yes, this is all. There is nothing interesting going so far in the iOS 18.5. At this point, what interesting is going to be is going to be definitely iOS 19 and the iPhone 17. I'm excited for that. Are you excited for the iOS 19 and the iPhone 17? Let me know in the comment section below. From you guys, I was getting requests regarding iPhone 17 videos. So I will definitely try to come up with that video this week very, very soon. So yeah, this is all. iOS 18.5. Beta 4 is here. I'm going to install the update right after this video. You can't expect anything in terms of features. But yes, battery life is better and performance is also improving. Well, this is all from this video. And I hope to catch you guys in my next video. Until then, take care. Peace out.